you all today we are here with another topic and this time it is manners of articulation manners of articulation is uh, the topic from the contents of the subject phonetics and english phonology english code 203 these uh, are this lecture series program is from the syllabus of the university of punjab so let's begin our today's topic here it is a complete chart of all the types of manners of articulation and number one is a stopped sound number one manners of articulation and those sounds are known as a stopped sounds as p, t, k, b, d and g these sounds are uh, pronounced as block airflow let it go abruptly we block our mouth and abruptly release the sound. So such sounds are known as stop sounds in English. And here is another kind of uh, manners of articulation. Those sounds are known as fricative sounds. As f, t, s, ch, h, w, t, z, and sound almost block airflow let it escape through a narrow gap so these sounds when we are pronouncing it is with the manner that we block airflow of the mouth and escape through a narrow gap as this sound z in rough so this is how uh, fricatives are here is another manners of articulation and that is affricates. Affricate sounds are ch sound and j sound. Ch like in cheap and rich and j sound in jeep and rage. So these sounds are pronounced as combine a brief stop with a fricative. So this is how uh, we are pronouncing and say these are called the affricates sounds here is another manners of articulation and those sounds are known as nasal sounds nasal sounds are ma na and ng lower the velum let air flow out through nose so these are also known as uh, nasal sounds are those sounds which are coming from nasal cavity here is another manners of articulation and those sounds are known as liquids. Liquids are L and R sound. Raise and curl tongue, let air flow escape round the sides. So these sounds are known as liquids. Here is another manners of articulation and those are known as glides. Glides are V and Y sound. Y in yes or y in you and v in we and v in want move tongue to are from a vowel so such sounds or these sounds in english are known as glides so these are actually the total manners of articulation we learn in english and here is actually the chart given and as a whole we have uh, given this chart Places and manners of articulation. Places of articulation we already have done in our lecture number 7. You may watch our previous video. And this chart is a complete chart in which places, manners and uh, voice and voiceless sounds are actually divided completely. Hopefully this would have been very helping lecture for all of you. These all uh, notes are taken from the books or sources, the study of language 6th edition or 4th edition by George Yule. I mean some notes are taken from 6th edition and uh, a few notes are taken from 4th edition. And number 2, English Phonetics and Phonology by Peter Roach. And number 3, that is Images and Definitions from Google.com. So this is actually the complete study of uh, manners of articulation.